Steve from ABC and today we're at the headquarters for Mercedes-Benz Australia Pacific in Melbourne and we're taking the brand new Mercedes-Benz City 45 minibus for a spin. It's the first one of its type in Australia. And Justin Whitford is General Manager of the Mercedes-Benz Bus and Coach Group in Australia. Our low floor City 45 product is, uh, is groundbreaking and it's providing, uh, I guess, a flexible and new opportunity for regional centres, even applications with short term movement of uh, people from retired services leagues clubs, for retirement villages, short term transfers. It's an exciting product, uh, it creates enormous cost efficiencies for operators and uh, they're saving significant amounts of money in the original purchase price also, so uh, it's a pretty cost effective option for them. We'll have a standard entry level product and also a luxury edition. Um, it'll be in the, in the mid hundreds, to be specific, probably ranging between the 135 to 140 and up to even 170, depending on how much you're wanting to specify. It's obviously a product that's very orientated around the, the safety side. And so the City 45 will obviously come standard with the automatic transmission. It's high on fuel efficiency. Your servicing period's around the 60,000 kilometres which is a wonderful change from what the industry is used to. Apart from that, uh, typically you'll find that we will have products coming in with uh, seating from overseas, but we're also wanting to provide the industry with the opportunity for locally manufactured seating products. So that way uh, we're supporting the local industries and giving the, the operators some flexibilities around that product. It can be uh, obviously implemented into uh, bus operation because of the style of design of the product, but it's also uh, going to be able to be moved into other areas, as I've mentioned previously. Depending on the seating application the operator wants, the actual seating can be around the 16 mark, but up to 19 or 20. You can reduce that and increase standing room. It's a very flexible product with regards to its seating application. Seat belts are a critical inclusion. We're wanting to push the safety of the product. You have things like the automatic braking systems. You have lane departure warning systems, obviously ABS braking. Uh, the traction control. So there's a range of benefits that you, or range of features that you're used to hearing in passenger cars that we'll now have in the minibus program. Uh, we spent considerable time in the UK because of their right hand drive. So that was a simple approach for us. It allowed us to bring products into Australia without the enormous engineering cost to redevelop left hand drive. That was a good outcome, but certainly the upgrade of the current model has only just recently arrived in Europe also ahead of the uh, requirement of the industry, which we did previously in our heavy bus with Euro 5, and we're planning to do that again, obviously, with the minibus with Euro 6. For us, with the ageing population, there is so many applications that we can apply these products to in the low floor, we'd be silly to ignore that. So that was certainly a key driver for us in this change. The wheelchair access in these products, uh, not just in the, in the low floor City 45, but also in, in some of the other products, we have dedicated vehicles that are very much orientated around the disability access. So we have the choice between just simply the manual ramps being put out, but also full uh, lifting capacity on the rear of the vehicles for, uh, for other uh, applications. We've had our drive in the City 45. I have to say it's very impressive. It's a, a small motor, but it's uh, quite talky. Plenty of pickup when you need it. Good fuel consumption, we're assured. And uh, it's got all the bells and whistles if you want them. We weren't able to test out all the different safety options that are available. But the braking is uh, absolutely superb, all in all a good unit. You can read a full review of the City 45 and the current issue of ABC.